Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. This is Kitty and today I am working on a 10 by 20 canvas and I will be doing a flip cup using Lucas Krill Green Earth you go and creative inspirations cadmium yellow hue and liquitex basics gold because i absolutely love these colors together i've done dutch pours with them i did a <laughs> I attempted a um, the dip where you put the paint on one canvas and then you dip it. Can't think of what it's called right now, but I tried that and but I, I love these colors together. So I've already put my paint in my cups because. I am a slow pourer and that is to save time. So I'm going to flip them and just like that and like that, like that. So none of my paints have silicone. Um, I did not spray my cups with the WD-40. All my paints are mixed one part paint, two parts Floetrol, and a little bit of water for consistency. And of course I'm going to say I hope I have enough paint. So. <clears throat> I really do. Probably should have done four, but I don't know. We'll see. I think they each had um, three to four. I think they are probably closer to four ounces per. So I think I'll have enough if they all, if it all drops. I'm just kind of giving them a little bit of time. I think I'll do that. Let's see what we got going on. I love these colors together. And the gold when it when it dries. Oh my goodness. You guys have seen my um my uh Dutch pours that I've done. And when that gold dries, it's just it's really awesome. Alright, so I'm going to start in the middle and just, I'm just going to lift it. Do that. Do that. Get on the corners. That's pretty. Alright. <clears throat> so, I'm going to torch it. Let's just get the bubbles out. Okay. 
then let's see what we got here. Did not want that to go over. It's really green and yellow. I mean, you can see the gold right here. <clears throat> and I'm really hoping that it comes out more. Right now I'm just trying to kind of get it a little closer to the edges. Not really sure if that's a good thing to do, but we will see. Alright, so I'm going to have to do a corner here. I think I'll do this one first. Because i got to go over it at some point, right? I'm really concentrating. <laughs> Can you guys tell? It's already looking kind of stretched, which I mean, we'll see how it, how it comes out. All right, one more corner, and then we'll see 
Let's see what we got. Now I'm just trying to trying to make something of it without <clears throat> without continuing to stretch it so much because I know it's really really stretched out. I'm just kind of checking my corners here. All right. That's pretty green and yellow. So I'm going to torch it. <clears throat> I'll see if anything comes up. At least get all the bubbles out. and focus here. Just want to make sure. There you go. So there is some stuff I think coming up. I know this gold here. I hope it will. <coughs> Sorry. I hope it will um, when it dries it'll have that nice shimmer. This is pretty cool how the dark kind of, um, what's that word? Not lacing, but, um, outlined those areas. That's pretty cool. It is pretty. I'm trying to look at it different, different ways here. I know it's just been a minute since I've torched it, but I'm going to do it anyway. <clears throat> so, I think, I think I'm going to leave it. I will probably torch it a couple more. I'll probably torch it in like a few minutes, but, um, yeah, I think I'm done with this one. So, I will bring it up for you guys. For a close up. I really like this this area over here, how it just outlined it.
hopefully that gold right there will peek through and do its do its thing, you know, all shimmery. But yeah, that's it. That is it, you guys. So, if you have not subscribed yet, please do so. If you liked this video, hit that thumbs up for me. And that's really pretty too. Hit, um, yeah, don't forget to hit that bell and you'll be notified when I upload another video. Um, comment, subscribe, hit the like button, the bell, all that good stuff, you guys. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Bye.